Modern photography has become ubiquitous as a rich communication tool in everyday life. We have imaging systems in many of our devices, including consumer cameras and mobile phones. Today's high-quality imaging systems require complex lenses, such as those of a DSLR or smartphone camera. These complex optical stacks aim to combat aberrations of all kinds, but they come at the cost of complexity, production cost, and large form factors. In particular, wide field of view imaging requires especially complex optical stacks. Recently, a large body of work in computational imaging has explored thin plate optics as an alternative to compound lens systems. These optics are typically designed using micro or nanostructures on a glass substrate, with the most common two classes being diffractive optics and metasurfaces. Although their form factor and design freedom allow for novel designs, the image quality, even when paired with state-of-the-art deconvolution methods, does not hold up to existing compound lens systems. Especially for off-axis regions, where existing methods fail due to the large aberrations, no existing method allows for thin plate imaging. In comparison to existing thin plate computational imaging methods, the proposed method achieves substantially wider field of view due to a well-motivated co-design of the point spread function, or PSF, and learned reconstruction. To this end, we design a dual mixture PSF that trades off focal powers across the full field of view while still preserving fine details and local contrast. We note the insight that the early feature layers of recent deep models are gradient-like filters that capture local contrast as essential low-level information content. This provides guidance for our PSF engineering. Next, we exploit a learned reconstruction that uses a deep network in a robust learning framework, together with automated training data acquisition to recover high-quality color images. We present measured PSFs for an off-the-shelf aspherical lens and the proposed lens system. The diagonal field of view of our lens is 53 degrees with a clear F number of 1.8. The aberrations of the proposed optics are almost spatially invariant, in sharp contrast to the aberrations of the aspherical lens. Moreover, our PSFs show a dual mixture distribution, containing a sharp peak and a low frequency tail. These structures help to encode local image contrast. The proposed image recovery removes aberrations and artifacts of all kinds by effectively using the peak component present in the PSF. The inverse problem of our image formation model is highly ill-conditioned because the PSFs are of a very large size. This causes existing deconvolution solvers to fail. We instead propose a deep neural network architecture that is trained in a semi-supervised fashion using automated training data generation. In particular, we enforce a combination of robust loss functions that, in contrast to existing supervised methods, allow our network to generalize to real data. Please refer to the paper for additional details. We have built a display and capture hardware setup that allows us to generate a large amount of training data without the need for significant calibration efforts in the wild. This is realized by capturing images that are sequentially displayed on a high-resolution calibrated LCD monitor. We manufacture two deep Fresnel lens prototypes, a dual surface design and an ultra-thin single surface one. Both have the thin plate form factor. We use a precision diamond turning machine to fabricate our prototype lenses, which both have a clear aperture of 23.4 mm and an effective focal length of 43 mm. We fine-tune the learned reconstruction using the same network, data, and training methodology with an aspherical lens and our designed lens. The proposed lens exhibits much better quality in off-axis regions. These results demonstrate the significant improvements gained by using the mixture PSF design in tandem with the reconstruction algorithm. Next, we demonstrate experimental results captured with the manufactured lens prototypes. Please enjoy these captured photographs.